Uh, economic leaders from all the APEC economies will be meeting in Port Moresby in November and they'll, be, they'll do what we usually ask of leaders. They'll come in and they'll review the work we've been doing and they'll give us some directions for going forward for the next year. Some of the work they'll be reviewing will be about helping economies continue to grow but grow in a sustainable way and there's some particular focus that Papua New Guinea has put on that uh, meaning growth um, for people in remote areas, growth using resources, growth that's sustainable, and above all, growth that's inclusive. It's given us a chance to hear Papua New Guinea's ideas. Um, some of those are quite traditional, and some of them they're trying to do quite new things, like make a digital economy issues work in an economy which is remote, got a lot of its population still living in villages, very low road access, low connectivity generally, big resources, but big problems getting those resources out. And then in addition, looking at the conditions for trade and continuing to review progress on the Bogor goals. And we'll be looking at impediments to continued free and open and increasingly we say fair trade as well. And that'll be structural issues around behind border barriers to trade. So all of those things, We'll continue to look at work that's been going on for some time on connectivity and quite a big focus on digital issues. Well, our big expectation and hope is that we see broad support to keep the whole region moving forward on regional economic integration, despite the fact that it's a time when we know there's quite big concerns about some of the effects of anti-globalisation, which we think are quite specific and can be defined quite closely, but whereas the benefits of globalisation have been huge, and most economies are saying they want more of it. So we want to see that moving forward, um, even though it's been a difficult year for that. And I think we will. Uh, we need to know where particular economies have got worries. Um, we, this time last year, met in Vietnam, a very big meetings, and we've got a clear idea of how to keep things going. That's the objective for this year as well.